Hi there Aquarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your reading now. This is for July 13th through July 31st. What do you have for Aquarius? What do you have for Aquarius? Please provide your clear, divine, guided messages for Aquarius. For July 13th through the 31st, regarding love, we're looking for love for Aquarius. A love reading. So I had, this is my second try for you guys. The first reading, before I even dealt any cards, I was having a conversation with you about bitching. And I think, you know, I was saying we're all bitches sometimes. So, we are. So I think, and that's male or female. I think that there's been some bitching going on in your relationships. And then, you know, apart from that, there's been bitching. Then a silence. Not talking to you days it could go on for days hours hours and hours I'm done I'm not talking on another word look at that okay so that came out as well um <coughs> where there's like a silent treatment going on July 13th through the 31st the end of something big we have a fire sign here uh Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be any other sign that acts like this. Um, end of a difficult situation. And, uh, a difficult end of a difficult situation in regards to um, let's get some more cards. I don't want to say anything. Hold on. Might as well get the rest of the cards before I go any further. end of feeling hurt over something you know deciding to not be a victim standing up standing up for yourself and deciding to take a step in a direction having confidence being strong um ready to start a new a new that's good enough ready to start a new <coughs> now this is july 13th through the 31st and then you're and then you're feeling good you know you've decided to um Whatever it is that's been bringing you down or made you hit a, a really bad point, I think that's over, and you're gonna you're gonna stand back up with confidence, and you're gonna want to work together. Okay, it looks like you're gonna want to, because this is what this guy does. He works together, and it's a fire sign, but it can be anybody else who's creative and fun, and passionate and um, social, very social. And this person compliments you, all right? They, um, you know, they're making you, perhaps it's a new, it's a new awakening, okay? It's a new um, breakthrough of some sort that leads you towards this person. Could be just, could be a soulmate. This is a, a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be a soulmate. Um... Do you know who this person is? It, because, I mean, down here we have you, you know. But perhaps, you know, you, or they're looking at you. Somebody's aware of it, okay? Somebody's aware of it.
Do you know who this is? I mean, have you been have you been talking to this person already? It looks like there's some deceiving. They make you feel good. They respect you. This person respects you. Okay? And perhaps there's some reason why there's some reason why you can't accept it. There's some reason why you can't accept this person that wants to come in. This person this person sees how hurt you've been. They see what you're going through and they want to work with you. They want to help you. That's what this, that's what's going on. They want to help you and they they've been talking you up. They respect you. They they think highly of you, but perhaps you can't really consider it because there's still conflicts and you really, there's still conflicts, you know, and there's been some lies and deceit over this. There has, um, has there been some cheating or, and, and when I say cheating, it doesn't even have to be sex to be cheating. Have you been is there been a three-way thing going on in your life where there is some kind of cheating, you know, or something like that? It looks like there's a triangle of some sort. Um, that's where the conflicts lie, you know, and you're not able to accept the love that's being offered to you because there's, there's still conflicts, probably with this person, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, because... This is you, Aquarius, you know, and it looks like there's a lot of fighting. I mean, they're both, I mean, red faced, both of them looks like there's a lot of fighting going back and forth, a lot of mean words and unhappiness. Um, and this is about doing what's right for you and making something final. Okay, so this is towards the uh, 20th about you know, of July or whenever it resonates for you that you finally decide that the conflicts are too much for you. You, you Perhaps you don't want to be in a love triangle of any sort, you know, and so you speak your mind to this Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, you know, and it's something that's been in the works for a while. It's, this isn't new, okay? So... Your soulmate appears to be right here, and it's, it's it's a breakthrough. Finally, finally, you've spoken your mind. There's a breakthrough towards this person who has seen your despair, okay? And you've been thinking about this for a while. You've been, like, stuck in this situation. How the hell am I going to get out of it? And now you're finally... You know, saying, okay, I think I'm going to do this. I might. You know, I'm going to step outside and walk a step closer. And then, you know, maybe, and that's right here towards this, because gonna, whenever it resonates, it resonates. But a few days later, you know, you might make a decision. It looks like you're going to, and you're going to do what's right for you. Okay, you do what's right for you, you communicate, and you know, there's going to be challenges with the communication. There is, I mean, there's challenges here, all right? Challenges and conflicts, it's not going to be easy. And, but the thing is, is you are headed down a new journey. You are, this is the last card in the deck. When this card comes up, it means something has been learned, something has been accomplished. Okay, so you start your new journey, and as soon as you do, this, per, this there's like a, a union of some sort with somebody, and I can. This is like a soulmate union. Okay, so and here's and here you are. All right. We're going to see what we can get for clarifiers. Resisting. Are you resisting making this change because you're worried about your security? Or because um, 
you just don't have time for it. Things are moving so fast in your life that you just don't have time to make the change. All right? You're just resisting it because you just don't have time for it. Either way, there's going to be a split. This is a split. All right? Um... That's what it looks like. You're not gonna. You're gonna finally make a decision to, because things have not been going as planned. Things didn't happen the way that you wanted them to happen. Okay. So there's gonna be some kind of breakthrough, which is gonna move you in another direction. It is. It's gonna move you in another direction. I think this this awakening has already happened for many of you and it's just been in the preparation stages it just hasn't come to fruition yet but it's coming it is definitely coming you're gonna make a final decision if not in July soon after if you haven't already some of you may be stuck just plainly plainly because of time it could also be because of money fear of you know not having enough money but there's nothing to be afraid of because this person up here he works as a team and he is mature he is mature he can take care of you he or she Now, this is a love reading, so this is meant for lovers. Yeah, you're ready. You can't, it's just about killing you. You have, here you're near death, and this person sees it. This person sees how much it's killing you. Okay, this could be a mother or a father as well. Okay, seeing your despair. In the other reading, I asked, I said, are you thinking about moving to home to your mother, your father? We had moving, and we had like a mother and father right there, and it felt like you were thinking about going home. All right, and we had the happy home too. Um, so that's what it felt like. So here it feels like you're gonna make some kind of decision and it doesn't have to be moving home it could be moving away from the despair all right to start a new journey then it's because it's been killing you like you know what's going on how long can you live with it that is the question until you do what is right for you that's your justice when you do what is right for you that's justice get a couple more actually we're just gonna get two of these oh, the world again twice right together a job well done joy contentment and gratitude the path toward enlightenment this is again last card in the deck a new major life change is upon you the chariot was in your other reading and it was right here major life change you're you're moving to something different you are major life change is in your path okay major it's something that i think you know about you've been expecting it but you have been holding back you just haven't stepped okay you've been resisting it hoping for the best Oh, jeez, I'm going to got it again twice. When you have it twice, it's a big energy. Being too frivolous or too cautious with money. It's about resisting. You're, it's about being too cautious or not giving the right amount of time to a relationship. Not really working on it. That's what it's about. It's about working on money instead. That's what it's about. It's about putting your time tour into um, other things other than a relationship. Okay, that's what it's about. What do we have for romance for Aquarius? It looks like they're they're making some big changes this month. Maybe towards the end of the month, you know. 
I don't know. There's just I see that there's still some arguments. I'm sorry to tell you that. You have to take back your control. Was it was the emperor in this one. I think it was in the other one. You need to take back control because the emperor, emperor was in the other one. Then that says that you need to take control. Okay. Sorry, I'm going to mess with the camera for a minute just to uh, so you can get a better view, hopefully. All right, that's good enough. So yeah, the emperor was, if it's not way under here, it was in the other one. It's about taking back control, discipline, being, <laughs> acting logically, okay? In fantasy, there was a lot of fantasy in the other one about how, um, you, it's too good to be true. The relationship that uh, something was too good to be true. And it doesn't mean that, like I said, are you thinking about moving back home? That could mean with your partner that you have. All right. It could be. This is a love reading, remember. It is safe for you to love. Open open your heart. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. You have to put effort into it. You have to. Bitching in the silent treatment, that doesn't work. I mean, it really doesn't. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart and open, see, I can't talk. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. All right, it's safe for you to love. Open your heart and let it, what's that song, Desperado. You have to let somebody love you. That is the song, Desperado. By the Eagles, I think. I think Clint Black sings it too. Don't you draw the Queen of Diamonds. The Queen of Hearts is your best bet. And the Queen of Hearts was in your other reading. That's funny. And it's a male or a female. And the Queen of uh, Diamonds was too. What is the Queen of Wands? That is so funny. It looks like you got to make a choice. And this is for... I would... You take it. If it doesn't resonate with you, then... You know, it's, gonna, it's not meant to. It, this will resonate with who it is supposed to resonate with, okay? That's just the way it is. If it doesn't resonate with you, it's because it wasn't meant for you. Don't take it personally. I won't. <laughs> oh. oh, was this one in this reading or the last one? Yeah, it was in this one. I see it. I saw it. I knew it. Yep. Uh-huh. Big time. Big time. And that's why you're starting a new journey. That's why you have the, the two world, world cards right here. And it's time to make a final decision because that's your justice. And that's why you have been in a near-death feeling, you know, like I, I don't even know if I, what the hell I'm going to do next because I've hit rock bottom, okay? Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Is it one or two people? Huh? Who? Huh? Who's wearing the mask? Is it you or the other person? Or could it be both of you? One more. Don't shoot the messenger, please. I can't, I'm not going to make it into something it's not. 
just to get a bunch of likes and I love yous. No, that's not me. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, universe, gods, if spirits, and angels. I love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That's your main message. It doesn't mean that you have to get a divorce or whatever the case. I mean, it may. It's up. It may mean that. It doesn't mean it for sure because everybody's different. It's time to take back control of your life. Free yourself. You've hit rock bottom. Where do you go now? It's time to take back control of your life. Make a final decision. If you want to move, move. It can't, it can't be wishy-washy. That kills. Stress kills. You got a lot of stress there, honey. Lots. Stress kills. So, Aquarius, that's what I have for you. Um, I wish it was better. I do. And please do not be upset with me. I know I know that um, I've had some issues with um, people who get, don't like my readings because they're so blunt or, you know, they're not as sweet as they'd like. But um, they're not as prettied up. It is what it is. I'm not going to change it. It's just the way it is. I'm not going to tell you it's something it's not. Um, thank you for coming to me. I really appreciate that. I aim for positive messages. I hope that this was positive enough for you. Like I said, I can't. It is what it is. It is positive because you are about to start on a new journey. And whenever, when one door closes, another door opens. And when, and with this world card twice, it's a very big, big deal. And it's a victory, okay? It's a victory. You have it twice. So, um, it's time for you to make a decision. A big one. You need to make a decision. A final decision. This is a final decision. It's time. You can't keep playing this game anymore, okay? It is time to free yourself, okay? Take back control of your life. You matter. You matter. That's what I have. 